Hi everybody, this is Todd V. And I'm Erin Ludlum. Welcome to Arts Quest. Today we have a musical guest, the Shivering Timbers. Oh, <laughs> oh, they're not pirates. <laughs> no, they're not. They're... It sounds piratey, I know, but actually, not anything yeah. like pirates at all. Not at all, but neat people. I like hanging out with them. <laughs> yeah. Well, like pirates aren't neat. Pirates can be scary. You know, pirates are not Sometimes what we see. Neat is cool and scary. Like they'll gut you with a hook. <laughs> not, well, pirates aren't like they are in Peter Pan. If you cross them. Yeah. Some pirates might be cool. They're I don't not know. All they like might be Jack neat. Sparrow. We don't know. I'm just saying. They're not Jack Sparrow. Well, we don't know. Anywho. Anyway. Anywho. I cool people to hang out with because they have a neat story. How they got into music business. They started by singing lullabies to their kid. See, I'm sure, yeah, a lot of people yeah. with any kind of musical background, you know, you don't try anything. To get them to shut up. <laughs> Please. Please. But as it turns out, they were writing some pretty good music. Right. And people, that adults liked. <laughs> that adults said, hey, you should maybe try making this a part of your life. And so they did, and it's, it's one of those shows. I love it when it happens. And people are like, oh, cool, we're here to check it out. And they started playing it, and we're like, wow, are we glad we came here to see these guys? Because mm. it, it just stopped everybody in their tracks. Okay. See, definitely not your normal lullaby. No, no, it was definitely a lot of fun with an upright bass and guitar. It was, well, you know what? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll quit talking. You can go see it. <laughs> I'm Sarah Ben. I'm the lead singer of Shivering Timbers. And I'm Jason Ben. I play guitar in Shivering Timbers. Uh, the band started out uh, shortly after the birth of our daughter, Susie, and we started writing songs for her. And there was a lot of nursery rhymes at first. And uh, well, and then. My friend Chuck gave us a couple of lyrics which made us kind of start branching out into more adult territory as far as uh, lyrics go. And so then we started writing our own more adult-ish songs, but we still do a lot of nursery rhyme type stuff too. It'll be on the next album. I just recently heard somebody describe it as freak folk, and I kind of thought that was cool. <laughs> I don't know. I'll, I'll probably like that for a couple of weeks and then get tired of it. We've both been in the music scene for a while. Yeah, I've Different been bands. playing in a band since I was in high school. But this, we've only been doing this for almost two years now together. So. You know, we're completely independent, and I do all the booking and management myself. So um, combine that with you know raising a child and keeping a home that's not a total disaster. <laughs> And Jason working full time, you know, we're kind of limited, so um, <clears throat> I would like to be gone every weekend, but that's kind of, you know, where we're at right now is just like weekend stints and, um, you know, until it like, until somebody calls us up and says, hey, we're getting, you should quit your job and just come on the road and we'll pay you like, a lot of money for it, <laughs> then, you know, but he's not going to quit his job. Don't fire um, We do a lot of Ohio gigs, but... We've gone down to Nashville a couple of times. Asheville and Louisville and St. Louis and Chicago. Chicago. Um, we might be heading out for a festival out in Iowa in a couple of months. And yeah, I'm just trying to get out. Actually, I'm, a, I'm in the middle of booking a New York City trip. I didn't even tell you that. I think maybe right. in May we'll be in New York and Brooklyn, actually. Um, we're just trying to do as much as we can, you know, for what we And then, do. eventually, when our daughter's old enough, she's going to be playing drums with us, and we'll take her on the road, if she wants to. You can find us at www.shiveringtimbersmusic.com.
So that's the Shivering Timbers. Mm -hmm. that See, is you fun. like them. It's cool. That's some fun stuff. So mm -hmm. if you like them, check out their website. <laughs> Find out more. Maybe get some downloads. But find out what they're playing next because they're fun to watch. Also, check out our website. Yeah, that's right. I'm going to more things. She's there. And our Facebook page. And the Twitter. Don't forget to like us right there. <laughs> She's still. The, I know. I'm trying to point to the like. I'm trying to see this. <laughs> hey, we'll, uh... we'll see you next time. From the top then? This means roll. Okay. It seems rolling, more like rolling, clogging, rolling. but it's a roll. Keep them doggies rolling. <laughs> Rawhide. <laughs> okay. Through wind and wind. Weather. <laughs> Keep them together. She knows the whole song. <laughs> For real? Sorry. It's okay. I just didn't know you knew the whole Rawhide song. Head them up. Move them out. <laughs> <laughs>